Hey plant friends, welcome back to my channel. I am going to do a quick little shop with me. Um, just Home Depot and Lowe's. I was gonna do Walmart, but my Walmart's a joke, quite honestly. I don't think I'm gonna buy anything. I'm kind of looking for a moisture meter, whatever those things are called, where you can see the moisture or the humidity and temperature in your house. Babies, you all be good, okay? I'll be back soon. Bye, I love you guys. Some corn plant trees. Jacinas for fourteen ninety eight. Corn plant trees are the same place. Golden purples. Some bonsai trees. Ooh, look at this little totem pole they've got here. That's nice. That one's eleven ninety eight. It's not bad to have to have a built in hole. I really love these. You have such pretty foliage. These curtains are everywhere nowadays. I just got one of these. Definitely don't have the sunlight for it, but I thought I'd try it. I love them. Little baby guys in back here. Which is the one that I have. which I'm kind of on the fence about. I'm not sure if I want one. Oh, look at this. Wow, this thing, this leaf is massive. Wow. 
These are a hundred dollars. This is how we roll around in stores, and it's a workout. <laughs> I'm sweating. $17. This irrigation is beautiful. These little animal planters are so cute. which I mean come on guys just don't do that to yourself honestly <laughs> ferns are just the diva of divas like the Mariah Carey divas you know you know okay my haul for that was just this um dinghy <laughs> which I will let you guys know how it is um Home Depot did have that one Diefenbachia which I love and I want to come back for it it was only $15 um, I have no clue where I would put it, but I would make room for it because I need that thing in my life. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> and um, there was nobody in the store, thankfully, for it being a Saturday because talking well on or talking to a camera by myself would definitely be awkward if I had people around because I probably wouldn't have talked. <sighs> yeah, because I mean, that's just really awkward. <laughs> Okay, now off to Lowe's.
some more ZZ plants. Lots of ZZ plants. Some more Camille Dyfenbachia. Parlor palms. Ooh, some pearls and jade. <gasps> look at that. They look a lot like my mandula. Which kind of hard to tell them apart sometimes. Because like to me this looks like a mandula. Are they the same? Let me know. Peperomia Ginny. I have one at home and I have yet to figure out what makes it happy. Apparently they like humidity, so I'm trying that out, see how it does. Petonias, Dracinas. I really love Fetonias. I haven't had much trouble with mine. I don't really think they're as dramatic as people say they are. Oh, and look at these Syngoniums they have. I've never seen these here. Oh, I want one so bad. $3.98. Yeah. Hi, baby. Acacias are $11.98 for anybody that's wondering. I've been seeing more and more Hoyas when I couldn't find any for the longest time. Fifteen ninety eight for that. Okay, that was it for the indoor plants. There's a lot of people here and it's super awkward. So that wraps it up for this uh, big box shop with me. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below what city you are from and which one is better. Overall, I feel Home Depot takes a lot better care of their plants, and um, but Lowe's has more to offer. I've seen bear paws at Lowe's, which are just the cutest little things, but it was half dying. And then today I saw those org ears, which are adorable. And the Syngoniums, ugh, that's going to be my next purchase for sure. And Burrow's Tail, I've seen there as well. And yeah, I just think um, they just don't take the best care of their plants. Thankfully though, I haven't had a problem with pests for either store. I've heard a lot of stories of like people finding ant colonies in the dirt. And you know, like mealy bugs, just like bad stuff in general. So, just knock on wood and hope that continues, that good streak. I will see you all in the next video. Let me know in the comments below what kind of videos you guys want to see from me. And I will try my best to make it happen. So, have a wonderful week. Bye!